Okay, guys, good morning. It's your boy David from the Eclectic Electric Transport on YouTube. He lives behind bars on Instagram. So I wanted to talk to you guys about my sobriety. Today, I'm 117 days clean. So I wanted to share with you guys something about marijuana that I've discovered these last couple of months. I've been having anxiety attacks and is associated with uh, marijuana-induced anxiety. So for those who've been smoking for more than 10 years, if you smoke or hybrid, whatever they call it, it can cause a panic attack. And as men, we tend not to share that with our friends and family. Well, I'm here to tell you, marijuana-induced anxiety is a real thing. I suffer from it. And as of yesterday night, I decided to stop smoking marijuana. It was for medicinal uses. It was for my hip issues. It was for my arthritis. But from this point on, I'm letting it go. So I wanted to share that with you guys, just in case you were suffering from panic attacks and stuff like that. It was for medicinal purposes, I promise you. I don't, I'm past the ha ha, he he, giggly shit with marijuana. The problem is I've been having panic attacks lately and it is called cannabis induced anxiety. It is the worst. I wake up in the middle of the night, shortness of breath, gasping for air. It comes from someone who smoked more than 10 years. When you introduce hybrid marijuana into your system, it causes serious anxiety. So if you're having anxiety attacks and you smoke and you think the smoking is going to help you, it's what's bringing it on. So again, guys, cannabis induced anxiety is a real thing. It's terrible. It's hard to understand where it comes from, but I figured it out. It comes from cannabis use. So again, if you smoke marijuana, you've been smoking more than 10 years and you suffer from anxiety attack, just know the anxiety attack is coming from the marijuana. If you're hiding this from family and friends, I totally get it, especially men. It's associated that a man can't have a panic attack, right? Well, let's just change the fucking words. It's called an anxiety attack. So if you're suffering from that, just know it's coming from the hybrid marijuana. Yeah, it's a real thing, guys. And again, I'm 117 days clean off of cocaine. I kept smoking marijuana for my arthritis and caused severe anxiety where I wake up. He gasped me for air, reaching for my children, calling 911. And I kept it to myself because I wasn't aware of what I was going through. After some research, it is clear that it is cannabis-induced anxiety. So if you're suffering from that, guys, I, I hope that you understand you're not bugging out. You're not freaking out. You're just going through what most people don't realize they're going through. No more fucking cannabinoid-induced anxiety. Fuck that. I can't, I can't live like this, and I don't think you should either. So we put down the coke, we put down the smoke today. So again, man, I'm just super excited to be off cocaine. I'm super excited to come out in nature and enjoy myself, but I'm more so excited to share with you guys about what I found out about cannabinoid-induced anxiety. It's a real fucking thing, bro, which is wild. We associate cannabis with relaxation, right? We associate cannabis with chilling. That's not the case. No, 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 no. Now, again, this is from Cross Strains Marijuana. I'm going to use that opportunity to stop smoking, period. Come on, catch up, man. You got to wave them up. So, again, guys, it's your boy David from the Eclectic Electric Transport on YouTube. He likes behind bars on Instagram. And I'm off this. Moving through life like, boom. Follow me. Come follow me. Buckshot. Come follow me. Walking on a dune.